hi guys welcome back to my channel today's video is all about how to generate title if you have been following up from the first content i started this june which is about how to develop yourself on youtube starting from the best way and ways on how to get content ideas and after getting those content ideas now this is a video tutorial on how to get the right titles that will make people actually want to watch what you have inside so the first thing is click on your google hub and search for this website which is known as the contentrow.com and follow this step now as you saw earlier as i was moving on after the web it will take you to the content row. then you click on headline generator so this headline generator is where you input your title that is what you intend talking about in your video i would advise that you even do a keyword research first before you now actually do the video so you would have known the title you want to use and you'll be able to follow it up in your videos because youtube love think that i am um, algorithm also listen so it not some of the words you say in your video and know who to put your videos to so that's how i decide to continue making my titles now i just finished typing s recorder because i realized many of you who join my channel are all about s recorder and you want to know more so now this is some samples of titles ideas i can use to gain more traffic to draw your attention to my page as you can see there are different type and it's also telling me the one for evergreen the one for clickbait i know i don't want clickbait so i will decide the one i actually want and make sure i'm delivering in the video so that people can actually watch the video from the beginning to the end that's what youtube is all about retention so you are only getting a good title so that will make people actually want to watch and know what that is about and watch to the hand to make your watch hour a little bit faster as a starter on the house so now i just finished checking that app and i love those samples it gave me so i'm trying to create more ideas surrounding in shots so this time around i'm typing the in shot and these are the examples it brought out again sorry my data is a bit slow but yeah that's it so now it's about this varieties of topics i can talk about on that in short and ways on how i can put in shorts in those titles and it will make sense for my audience because some of you guys also want to know how to edit so you subscribe to my channel because of that so anything you search for definitely it says on the app should in case you want to re check or redo what you've checked so far but for me immediately i search for something and it brought out relatable headlines all i do is screenshot then i later go back and start checking which one i want to use because some are click based some are evergreen some are tropical so i prefer to use either tropical or evergreen on um, sometimes seasonal but i don't like clickbait because really it depends on what i'm actually talking about that would determine me anyway but so far i've not used anyone under the clickbait and i love to use any title that is of higher percentage some might have 50 40 but i prefer 50 and above because that shows a little bit high chance that people will actually want to watch that also i also love to use the evergreen types of content like any any searchable title it brought that has evergreen i love to use that also and the next thing is those scores actually tell you how those things are being searched for so anytime i finish searching for something i go back because if I should use that same page to search for the next thing, anything I upload, like maybe I type in S Recorder Trim or something, it's because S Recorder is still there, it will continue from where I stop. Like it will add S Recorder into what I'm searching for again. So, in order to remove that, all I do is to go back, that is, log out of the site, then click on it again www.contentrow.com and also so i'll click on it again then afterwards i will not start for what i came in to search for so i think this is okay 
now let's try and look for other type of keywords so you just have to use either three or four words then it's for the app to be able to generate headline for you and um, you know using the vidIQ app your title shouldn't be more than 60 words so you try as much as possible to check for titles that no more than 60 words so that you can be able to move better like connect with your audience better and it will be easier for them to be able to have a glimpse of what you are actually trying to do in that video so look at this particular one 70 it shows that the strength is nice and that's just something about this app it tells you all information you need to know about the quality score and all so you can see number draws attention it's trying to tell you why they made that title like that using numbers words and all of that so that's how it's give you hint on how to write a good title for your video so if you are using this continuously you'll be used to how to generate titles for any of your videos if you don't want to use the site but as a beginner as a starter you just have to use the site to learn and know better so i hope this is helpful welcome to my channel if you are new please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe and tell your friends people you feel will be interested to know more that this month is all about developing yourself personally in video creation and youtube on thus my channel so if you are interested all you have to do is to subscribe and wait for the next upload afterwards you learn and anything you are learning please implement that how to learn because when you finally understand it and you implement it you'll be able to get results so you won't say oh she's just teaching i'm not saying this you have to put in the work too so about the app we have compiling headlines matter no matter the medium blog title generator youtube generator title so the app is just so good clickbait title depending on what you actually just want to search for all you have to do is just click on the headline analysis or generator i use generator yes headline generator that's where i search after clicking on the generator then i type in the word i want to search for a title for then afterwards it gives me different options to choose from and i can refresh and reload for it to continue changing and giving me different point then i finally screenshot the particular one i feel is right and after doing all of this the next thing you can do to boost your video development after knowing the title is now how to describe so to know how to describe watch out for the next video which is how to give tags to your video so that will be coming out next week same time every wednesday and thursday i'll try my best to post twice a week so every wednesday and thursday by 4 pm join me let's learn something new to develop ourselves on this platform thank you so much for all my viewers thank you so much to all my new subscribers and thank you for everyone that has been supporting right from the beginning i'm grateful to you guys so cheers and let's meet at the top in that way in that process make sure you're implementing everything you're learning from this channel that way we'll be able to meet at the top Thank you guys. Till next time, stay safe and remain blessed. So you can just play around the hub and learn new things and figure out ways to generate your headlines better and the best way to actually get better and quality headline for yourself after multiple trials of using the app and you now know the strategy of ways on how to generate headlines then you can now say you are good to go in generating of headlines so i've been using these by the end of june coming the next month july we will be talking about the implementation result of everything we have been doing so far so this is all the things i've been using for this month and i'll continue using so i can be able to come back and tell you guys the result i've gotten so far so thank you guys for watching bye stay safe guys hey guys you can sign up into the hub for you to be able to use many of their other features yes but i think even without signing up you are good to go as a beginner okay guys bye